welcome back to the channel. So I've brought a new piece of kit, it's the new Adloft Dulux pillow by Trackology. And I just wanted to do um, a first look at it on, on the channel. So what I'll do first before I blow it up and have a look at it properly and open it up, I'll compare it to the, the 2.0. So there's the 2.0 and there's the new one as you can tell. There is a bit of a difference in the size. But you might be able to pack it down a little bit smaller, I don't know. So yeah, let's open it up. What I'll do, I'll open that one up as well and we'll compare the two together. Stay tuned. Let's get it open. Let's have a look. There's a little tag on it here. It says underpen. Basically it says it's not to be removed except by the customer the consumer so you can't take this off um, there's some specs on there as well I'll go through that in a minute All right, let's pull it out and have a look oh so the bag what it goes in is actually attached to the pillow itself can see it's got the strap and the padding let's get it let's blow it up let's have a look at it properly there with me Right, so it's got the strap like the, the 2.0 has. It goes around the back. And it's got like a padding thingy on it as well. So it's the same shape, the same feel look. There's the bag which attaches. The, the cover itself is actually detachable. So you can take that off and wash the cover when you feel fit to. It's got the same valve as the 2.0, so you know you get the thingy valve. You press it once to let it go and the thingy. So yeah, that's blow it back up. So there's that one. Let's see if we can get a close look at the texture on it. The strap. It hasn't got the dots on that the, the 2.0 has. So what I'll do, I'll blow that one up now and we'll compare them together. Bear with me two seconds. Right guys, so there we have it, there's the 2.0 and there's the new one. Just put a bit more air in this so it feels more firm. Right. There's the new one, there's the old one, it looks a tad smaller when it's blown up, if you have to... yeah. So that's the new Dulux one and it looks like I said it looks a bit smaller than the, the 2.0 in comparison. So what I'll do now, I'll run over some specs of the new one with you and yeah. For that, I'll be back in a minute. Right, guys, so what I'll do, I'll compare the specs to the Dulux and the 2.0. Right, so the pack size for the new Dulux is 6 inches by 4 inches, and the 2.0's pack size is 5 inches by 2 inches. The weight, the new one, the new Dulux is 120 grams and the 2.0 is 110 grams. Um, this one only comes in black, in grey, and the 2.0 comes in all different colours as well. Um, it's got a removable pillowcase, detachable strap like that one has um, for easy cleaning. 
Um, what else can I find? Inflated dimensions. Let's have a look at that. So inflated dimensions is this one is 16 by 11 by 4 inches and that one is 16 by 12 by 4 inches so just quite literally a centimetre difference somewhere not a, not a centimetre, an inch difference somewhere I'm working the bag so what I'll do, I'll inflate it and we'll see how we take the, the cover off it's a nice cover, it's nice and soft yeah, bear with me two seconds, I'll bring you back in there. Alright guys, so let's inflate it, like I said, it's got the same same valve system as the 2.0, so when you want to think you can just tap it, see it's all there. So what I'll do, we'll put it down, and we'll see how this detaches. So I think, yeah, so it just pulls off. Falls off, but I don't know. Don't know how to get the valve off because the valve. Oh, there we go. Yeah, so it all just pops off like that. And like I said, it's similar. So let's let's blow it up without the cover on. Let's have a look there. There it is without the cover on. So in, in theory, it's a 2.0, but with a cover. So but you can tell the size difference there. If you look, it's bigger compared to the new one. 2.0 is. Yeah. So yeah, so that's what it looks like without the cover on. I will be able to use it in that as well. I don't know, it feels a bit weird. So let's get the cover back on, let's see how easy it is to put back on. It was a right bargain as well because um, somebody posted on one of the groups yesterday that it was um, on Amazon. And um, basically, Amazon were giving you a £9 promo code. So I only technically paid three ninety nine for the pillow itself, and at that price, gonna gonna miss out really. So right, let's try get this back in. See if it's easy or not. Right, open the valve first. <laughs> open the valve because then you can put the the thingy through the hole. There we go. Alright, let's, let's give it a blow up, see if we can get it go normal again. So if you're wondering about the bag, because I've been thinking about it now, I think you can take that thing off and the bag can just slide in. Because like obviously it's on the underside anyway. So, so you won't really have the problem with the bag being in the way neither if you think about it. Um, that is really really comfy it feels so, I've used this a couple of times that feels that feels like it fits properly this feels like it's just right it's it feels better if you know what I mean it feels better on you on your face and, and on your skin now the test is How easy it go? <laughs> How easy is it to go back in the bag? Let's have a look at that then. Let's it down again. 
I'm trying to do this in one take, so if I do pause, <laughs> I haven't forgotten recording. I'm just trying to thingy do it properly so you can get all the air out of that. So what I tend to do is I tend to leave the valves open because then if there's any trapped air it can get through the valve. So what I'm thinking is fold it up like that Going off like that. And try feed it in like so. Yeah. So it goes back in easy enough. Yeah. There's that there's that tag I was telling you about. It's on it. I'll most probably cut that off soon. So, as well, let's have a look. Oh. So, yeah, it's still it's still bigger compared to the other one. Yeah, so there's 2.0. But, but, what can I say? Four quid, proper bargain. Um, I know they're out of stock at the moment, but what I'll do anyway, I'll put the link in the description for Amazon or you can search for yourself on, on Amazon for get reminders for when they're back in stock and what I'll do is um, hopefully soon I'll most probably do another a camp in the car and I'll give you I'll, bring, I'll come back to you and give you a, um, a review on the pillow of what it's like how it performed overnight or I might just do a living room camp um, so yeah, so I'll leave it here, thanks for watching, and I hope you manage to get one, eventually, when they're in stock. Like I said, if Amazon put a £9 offer on, who ain't going to snatch it up? I quite literally went on yesterday, and there was loads left in stock. Within a half an hour of me ordering it, it was out of stock. So, <laughs> it's just one of them, so a lot of people are going to have these floating around. So yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll update you whenever I get a chance to use it in one of my videos or something. So yeah, there we are. Trekology, a loft, pillow, Dulux. Peace out guys.